Hello, my name is Caroline and I work with SEAI. In this video, we're going to learn about how energy is stored and released. Have you ever seen one of these vitamin tablets? Do you know how they work? When you put the tablet in water, it dissolves and it creates a vitamin rich drink. This tablet is made up of lots of different chemicals and these chemicals have stored energy. They make this happen. When the water and the tablet meet, the stored energy is released. Look closely. You can see the energy being released in the form of bubbles. What do you think would happen if I put some water and the tablet into this canister and I close the lid? The stored energy will be released, but then where will it go? Let's have a look. What happened this time? When the water and the tablet met in the canister, the stored energy was released and it changed into moving energy. When the lid was closed, the energy was building up and it had nowhere to go, so it caused an explosion. This is an example of how energy can be stored and released. Can you think of any other examples of where energy is stored? What about your food? How do we release energy from food? And fossil fuels. How do we release energy from fossil fuels? Why not have a chat in your class and talk about the things that store energy and what we do to release this energy?